can't see them, she said, with her face to the glass, on the very tip top of her toes. She went back to the bed as the high honkers flew past, and her mother woke up from a doze. Twilight was spreading its blanket of night, the evening forgetting the drowsy daylight. The girl got some bedding for the woman so white, then kissed her with questioning lips. They were right over the house. Their wings swished on my head. She grumbled in a dimpled disdain. Escaping down south, she said, kicking the bed, as her pale parent winced with old pain. The least they could do as they fly by today is to give us a view. Through what the child meant to see, the woman spoke up, though so sick. The view out the window is just a piece of the sky. Sometimes you hear the gray geese school, but you can't see 'em fly. Sometimes your heart aches inside, so you feel. God knows, but He don't tell you why. 'Cause the view out the window is just a piece of the sky. I won't let you go, Mama. I just plain refuse. She said, looking out at the stars. I'll miss you so, and Daddy needs you. Besides, what will we do with two cars? The wind off the hill came and jiggled the pane. Sorrow just spilled from their hearts once again. Then the room got so still as the woman explained the mercy that turns you to tears. Now God's. Got a house and a place set apart, with a porch that sits over the sea, and he's fixed up a room that looks out from his heart, and he's saving it just for me. But I'll gaze out his window to this world here below, and laugh in the wind blowing so. That my love for you has been growing, even though we've been apart through the years. The view out the window is just a piece of the sky. Sometimes you hear the gray geese go, but you can't see 'em fly. Sometimes your heart aches inside, so you feel you will die. God knows, but He don't tell you why. 'Cause the view out the window is just a piece of the sky. There were coats on the bed, and aunts in the hall, and a kitchen of small talk relief. Her mother was dead. And words were a wall behind which lay all of her grief.